All right, this is the uh, TCAP practice test uh, for math, grade 7. Question number 45. A triangle has side lengths of 16 and 20 feet. The measure of the included angle is 30 degrees. That's important. The included angle means the angle between the sides. So basically, I have a triangle. Maybe it looks like this. Uh, so this is 30 degrees. This side is 16, and this side is 20. This is the angle that matters. If they give me a, a different angle and it's not between the two sides, then I can't say anything about similarity anyway. It has to be the included angle. Um, which measures, uh, mission measurements can be the side lengths and the included angle of the corresponding parts in a similar triangle? Now, similar triangles have two things that make them similar. Number one, corresponding angles have to be congruent or they have to be the same thing. So if the included angle is not the same, then it's not the right answer. So in B, they say that the included angle is 60 degrees. Well, in the original uh, triangle, it's 30 degrees. So that cannot be the right answer. Same thing with D. It can't be the right answer because that 60 degrees has to be 30 degrees. Otherwise, they're not similar anyway. Now, uh, the other thing that it has to be, so I should write corresponding angle congruent. Uh, on the flip side, corresponding sides are proportional, where they make the same fraction. So uh, let's look at the relationship between them. It means that the uh, fraction that you make if you take the two smaller of the sides should be the same if you take the two larger of the sides. So let's you know look at the answer choices, and they'll make more sense. So in this case, I have 16 and 32 would be the two small ones. So I'm going to put 16 over 32. 16 over 32 is 1 half. The two larger ones would be 20 over 36. 20 over 36 is 5 ninths. They're not th the same. That doesn't look good, does it? Let's try C. Uh, in this case, 16 over 36 gives you 4 ninths. And then 20 over 45 also gives you 4 ninths. So that's our answer. Our included angle is the same. Check. And if I take the little sides, so the original small side from our triangle is 16, so I match it with the 36 and make a little fraction here, and it gives me 4 ninths when it's reduced. And the same thing happened when I took the 20, or the larger side, and then 20 over 45 also gives me 4 ninths. Check, check, all things are good, so my answer choice is, of course, C.